welcome back. We are with some of the toppers of CLAD 22 and we are going to be discussing some very important tips for all of you. First of all, let me quickly introduce you to all of them. So we have Akshat here. Akshat got an all-under rank 5 in CLAD 22. Then we have Urja who got all-under rank 10 in CLAD 22. We have Shida who got all-under rank 58 in CLAD 22. And then we have Sanjana who got all-under rank 7 in CLAD 22. So we are going to be discussing some very important tics, uh, tricks and tips uh, from them and we will discuss as to how did they proceed with their preparation, particularly in the last month. So uh, I'll start with you, Akshat. Uh, yeah. Particularly what happens is when we start preparing and in the last month, there is like a lot of things to do. It's mm -hmm. overwhelmingly a lot. Okay. How to plan that pure din mein. So generally the idea is to structure your day better so that you can get everything complete. Karte. So how did you work on that is something everybody would like to understand because everybody has this problem right now. Right. So like in my case, I also had my board exams in the last month of my flat preparation as well. So I had to juggle both the things together and the thing that I used to do was that I never used to like make a set timetable per se mm. but I would focus more on you know like making daily goals. So like okay if I have to solve these many exercises today I'm gonna do this. Yeah. So that gives you a lot of leeway as well. Like, I mean you can uh, commit to other things as well because that is also important I believe mm. in the flat preparation as well. Mm. You need some break sometimes. Yeah. But if you if you just make very realistic goals just don't go overboard yeah, it solves as many mocks as I want to. Yeah. You don't have to do anything like that. Just make some goals. Be consistent with that, I would say. Right. So I think that helps a lot. In so Akshat is from Kanpur and you should take a lot of pan breaks. Akshat <laughs> 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 developed some other hobbies also. So Akshat, what are your hobbies that you have developed at this point? You think that you have to keep the same for the exam. So like, uh, I used to like enjoy a lot of theatre and dramatics. So I would watch a lot of videos and I say I would just you're going to start enacting and things like that. Oh. So, like, 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 I, oh. not without an audience. Because so, that would actually be Now we know the content for the next video. I mean, that aspirant will be like, 12 coming, but rather, that guy will be like, you're 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 like, from like uh, preparation anxiety also about it. So how did you tackle the mistakes that you were making that you knew that this is going to bug me in the examination and I need to solve it right now? So I was making notes of my mistakes and critical reasoning. Uh, I had to revise all the concepts in the last month. So I referred to GMAT Bible to uh, read all the theory and practice the questions given and then I attempted the questions that I had attempted in the previous mock so that I could improve on those questions. As far as anxiety is concerned, the old, I feel the only way to over, overcome anxiety is to uh, prepare as much as you you can yeah. just because uh, you feel uh, that you've done enough. Yeah. And if the night before the exam you're able to say that you know I couldn't have done anything else, yes. that's the best form of preparation. Mm, yeah. yeah. <coughs> Shida, again, uh, look, last month may generally bahut sare things aise hoti hai jo kahi par miss hoti hai. Jaise miss in the sense kahi par galat bhi ho jati hai. Jaise ek mock test galat ho jana. That is a lot of, uh, you could say, that's a demotivating factor for a lot of students. So, would you comment anything on that? Because we have to come with that, we have to say that the preparation is fraud. Now, what is it? No, no. So, I think it's very important to remember that mock tests are not an indicator of anything. Mock tests are just tests that you're taking one for practice and another just to like analyze right. how your preparation has you know, come along. So, if it's gone wrong, then the best thing that can come out of it is that you analyze why it went wrong. What you, you know, what you might have possibly missed or if your state of mind was, you know, somehow disturbed. That is, sometimes the flower is just a flower and the best thing you can do for you is that. So, yeah. it's, it's oh that. My. <laughs> oh my god. No, it's I'm not going to I'm speechless. I'm Because it's like one of the biggest entrances exams of your life, so you're obviously 
scared. But it's it just practice, practice, practice. That, that's what I did. And like through every mock, I like fix my order. I decided my order of attempt. And the worse a mock goes, the more you learn from it. Yeah. So that's what I did. No, because most of the people want to make it to NLS when they're preparing for that. Right. But sometimes what happens is, many many students obsess with the idea of NLS so much mm-hmm. that if it doesn't happen, they feel that it's NLS or death. And the paper gave all the problems with that. So uh, how to deal with that issue because that is not the reality, right? Because we have a lot of people who are in the class, who are in the class. Uh-huh. So uh, did you have a plan B in case NLS mm-hmm. does not work out or you would say that Top five was like the priority, but generally it was. But what other things that you were thinking? If NLS is not there, what will I do? So like I never chased this dream that boy NLS he chayiye, or not? So because my graduation was bad or something like that. I was never into. I was like, okay, boy NLS is a college. Hai. And there are a lot of other yeah. good law schools yeah. as well. It's not like NLS is not that he will judge me. It's not that like we all are at NLS, and we know this for a fact. It's not like that. So just keep this in mind, and it's okay. I mean. It does not really make a difference because we know a lot of seniors. We know not know a lot of people who are from other law schools as well, and they're like they're phenomenal. Like they're beating NLS students at a lot of different competitions and even in legal writing and all of that. So it's not the end of the world, trust me. And sometimes you can feel like he, you're also like, okay, it's great. I mean, I'm the place that I am. I feel very comfortable here, and I'm enjoying my life. Yeah. So that is, I think, what you should focus on. This don't. This is all created by you know your your mentors. So you're seeing this. NLS is the only thing you need to chase, so don't go for it. Right. Last thing to all of you, I think, one, एक-एक करके तो बस बता सकते हो. Basic tips for the student in the last month. कि क्या मतलब तुझे उसे करना चाहिए और क्या नहीं करना चाहिए. तो तुम दोनों बता सकते हो क्या करना चाहिए. तुम दोनों बता सकते हो क्या नहीं करना. What should they not do while they're preparing for that in the last month? So I think uh, what you should do is that first of all, uh, like analyze your mocks a lot. So that helps more as compared to. You know, giving a lot of mocks right before your exam when you have just one month left. It's more important that you sit down and you even redo your mocks. Actually, that's what I did. I redid my mocks and I used to analyze. Okay, where did I get things wrong? So I think that helps a lot. You basically and do it in an untimed environment. So there you can focus a lot more on what's your logic, what's your reasoning, rather than you know uh, being under this pressure. Okay, I have, to, I have to complete this paper in such and such time. So I think that is one thing that that aspect yeah. should do in the last month of their preparation. Cool job. Yeah. I would just is focus on your preparation don't compare yourself to others don't give a lot of mocks because mocks are just meant to see where you're standing right now it is, does not matter um, uh, how many mocks you're giving in the last month at least for yeah, yeah exactly shida what should they not do in the last month they should not obsess over their mocks ha huh. जिंदगी रोकनी नहीं है जिंदगी चलती रहनी चाहिए तुम्हें देखने तुम्हें कैसे जीना है ठीक है तो थैंक यू सो मच गाइस फॉर अटेंडिंग दिस होप इट वाज यूजफुल इफ दिस एनीथिंग एल्स लेफ्ट यू कैन मेंशन इन द कमेंट बॉक्स वी विल बी हैप्पी टू टेक इट फ्रॉम देयर एंड आंसर इट फॉर यू गाइस थैंक यू